Hi, the movie that I chose to discuss is called Puncture. It stars Chris Evans as Mike Weiss and Mark Kaysen as Paul Danziger. Chris Evans' character, Mike Weiss, is a drug addict and a small-time attorney, along with Mark Kaysen's character, Paul Danziger, except for he's not addicted to drugs and he has a family. Uh, the main plot of this is that two small-time lawyers take on a large corporation to try to get them to implement uh, safety needles that would make the world a lot safer, for, especially for nurses and everything like that. And the entire movie is about their struggle with that and Chris Evans' character struggle with drugs as well. So the movie starts and the nurse that they go to represent has AIDS and she kind of explains to them that she doesn't want them to represent her but her friend who's got the safety needle and after meeting with them they find out that the medical supplies company doesn't allow or won't buy his needle because they have their needles and they don't want to use his needles and his needles a cool invention because once it's used once you can't accidentally get pricked by the needle which would save a lot of nurses lives and that really interests Chris Evans' character, who takes it on his own personal, like on his own personal way to make sure that this is a better place or a better world for people. And as the movie continues, the medical supplies company gets a big time lawyer, which he's got a lot more money than Chris Evans and Mark Kaysen's characters do. So he's able to like he's able to draw it out and stuff and their business ends up going under almost and they come to a point of an ethical dilemma when the large medical supply company offers them a large settlement if they sell over the copyright to the needle and uh, all the needles that the man has in his possession and for them that's the big ethical dilemma because they know that if they sell the needles to that company they will never be used and they can't ever try to use them again. So for the four ethical paradigms, the truth versus loyalty, uh, this is actually a paradigm from Mike which is Chris Evans character uh, because when he's offered the settlement he has to decide between the promise that he told his friend who's Mark Kaysen uh, he told him that once they got a settlement, he would take it, especially if the business was, if they had used all the money that their business had. Well, he has to go decide between that because he's supposed to be loyal to his friend, but he also wants the truth out and knows that by taking the settlement, he won't ever get the truth out. Uh, the next uh, ethical paradigm is individual versus community. Uh, for Mike, the community wins out because it's for the majority and the majority is nurses and everyone that's in hospitals that run the risk of accidentally getting poked by the needles that they use right now. Uh, for Mark Kaysen's character, it's about the individual because his wife just had a newborn child and the way that they were going they have no money and he's possibly gonna foreclose on his own home and he's trying to make sure that his child is taken care of. Now the short-term versus long-term paradigm uh, Mike has to decide between the short-term payout where everything's fine for his uh, law firm uh, versus long term of actually like struggling and fighting this medical supply company knowing that they have all the resources and Chris Evans characters they don't and he also knows that they could possibly win which would make the long term struggle worth it but he has to weigh those two and then the fourth paradigm is justice versus mercy which is not really applicable for this dilemma because he doesn't need justice or to show the medical supply company mercy. What he needs is the truth out and the community taken care of. Um, yeah, and so for Chris Evans' character, he decides to ignore the loyalty that he gave his friend and to try 
to take on this company. Um, yeah, and the resolution principles, the utilitarian is the first one, and it's doing whatever produces the greatest good for the greatest number. And in this dilemma, it would be getting those needles and fighting this company and getting those needles out there to save nurses' lives and anyone else in the medical profession. The deontological principle is do what you'd want everyone to do, which again, is the same thing. You, Chris Evans' character would want other people to try to do what's right and save everyone else. And then the golden rule is do it to others what you'd want done to you, which, I mean, it doesn't really apply directly, except that you, you could argue that by sticking up for his client and going out on a limb, Chris Evans is doing what he'd want someone to do for him as well. So... That's the ethical dilemma that they're faced with in this film. And the choice that ends up coming out is Chris Evans' character decides to go ahead and continue to pursue the case. But unfortunately, Mark Kaysen's character talks to the man who has them doing this lawsuit and convinces him to take the settlement. So, unfortunately for Chris Evans' character, the ethical dilemma even though he chose what he thought was right, doesn't get followed through exactly. And so Chris Evans' character goes and confronts the lawyer of the other company, and they kind of have a nice long chat. And then the next day, Chris Evans' character suffers some type of thing. I really don't want to give away the movie. Uh, but they end up actually continuing the trial, Paul Danziger, which is a character played by Mark Kaysen, they continue the trial and they're still fighting its day actually. It, it is based on a true story. And so that's the film and I hope you guys enjoyed the discussion of the ethical dilemma that the characters are faced with. And this is the works cited page if it focuses. Thank you.